Thanks for watching Tie to Throw. I want to tie a really cool steelhead tube fly for you today. So I already got some uh, medium and some small tubing on my needle. And the first thing I'll do is I'll create a little butt. Just wrap forward, overlapping each time. There we go. Cut off the excess. Now I'll tie my tail. I'll use some uh, fluorofiber for this. Tie it in on top. Double it over. Tie down. Taper from underneath. There we go. I'll tie in my ribbing. Some black wire. Black ultra wire to be precise. Tie that in and tie in my purple braid. I'll just wrap forward with my braid. There we go. I'll put some dubbing in here. It's a mix called McKelly Blue. It's a mix of blue and purple. Really nice dubbing with long fibers. And we're gonna overdress this a little because I'm gonna brush it out later. There we go. I'll rip my body. Five times. Cut the wire with a pair of old scissors. There we go. I'll use my dubbing brush to brush it up. Don't be afraid to give it a good brush. Here we are, really nice translucent body. So now I'll tie in some flash for under the wing. This color is called Rainbow from Hell. It's by Solar Synthetic Series, Michael Froden. Really, really nice flash. Five colors already pre mixed. Very nice. Taper it. Be ashamed to throw this away, so I'll tie this in as well.
Here we are. Some nice long flash. For a wing, I've already made a zonker, which I cut myself from uh, a skin of US opossum. Got this one at Foxy Flies, really nice stuff. A really nice long black wing. Tie that in on top. Make sure it's on top, yeah, looking good. Tie it down. There we go, nice wing. So now for my first Hackle, got a really nice pink ostrich feather. And as you can see, I stripped half of the feather because I don't want too much on it. Tie that in. Just hackle it and well, I think about two, two or three turns should be enough. Here we are. Tie that off. So now some nice jungle cocks. Just select two nice feathers of the same length. So I've got two really nice long jungle cocks. I measure them. And usually I just like to put them to the end of the body. Strip off the fluff. I'll tie one in on my own side first. It's looking good. The other side. And what I'll do now is I'll try to carefully double the stems back. Here we go. Just to make it a little more durable. Cut off the stems. We are. Now some rubber legs. In great material, see it in a lot of flies lately, and I just love them. Tie them in. And I'd like to double them over. Not on a tube fly because the tube is very really thick and you get a ugly big head so I'll 
Cut them off, tie them in on the other side. Two loose wraps. Yeah, that's looking good. Time down. Have a look. Yeah, that's looking good. Cut off the excess. There we go. And now my final hackle. I'll use, I like to use marabou because it's really thin, but the marabou is too long. So what I'll do, I'll create a little dubbing loop. Like so. Here's my loop. I'll place my dubbing twister in the loop. And I've already prepped Again, a clip with some marabou. I just love these clips, very versatile. So, then twist them. And with your scissors, get your rubber legs out of the way. Spin them again. There we go. Just fold everything back each turn you make. There we go. Tie off my loop. Get rid of the dubbing loop. Put a half hitch on here. And now you can place cones or discs or maybe a foam head in front of it. I think, you know, a bright pink one would look really cool. So I'll take my zapper gap. Put a little drop on top. A little drop on the bottom. Really firmly press the disc against the hackles. Keep it there for a couple of seconds. And you can let go. And meanwhile, as drying, I can trim my rubber legs. So I'll get them down, all of them together. Cut them to the same length. And then the bottom ones, I cut them a little shorter about a, a centimeter. There we are. Take the fly out of the vise. Cut it to the length you want. Get your lighter. Carefully burn the plastic down to the cone. Okay guys, so here we, uh, here we are. Very cool steel head fly. And it's not very difficult to tie, but it will take some time. But believe me, it's got a great action in the water. I really, really like the US opossum wings. Very, very nice. Right guys, thanks for watching. Check us out next time.